Hello everyone, welcome to Metaverse Insider. A new way of browsing experience with Firefox Reality. Open the apps and open the Firefox Reality. What appears in front of me is a big screen. We have on the left side Firefox Reality and some items under that. Featured today, perspective, interactive experience, spaces and places, and so on. We have the refresh, the home, and the search bar over there, and also the voice command or voice search. And on the left side, we have three small dots, and that is the menu over there and in here I have this small panel here we have the settings the library and the private browsing and this one is view tabs and the plus sign open a new window and the left controller right controller and also the headset uh, status let's uh, explore first the settings and when I click the settings I have here uh, some tabs. Let's see the language. As you can see, we have some languages that you may use and the display. And we have the enable carb display. It is on. If I put off, the screen becomes flat. But I prefer to have the carb, so I will put it on. You'll see it moves. Then we have the user agent mode either mobile or VR. We are on VR and also the display density, the home page and so on. And the privacy and security, developer options, sign into account and environment. At this time, we are on off world. See here. Let's go to controller options. Uh, we have the pointer color here, uh, either white or purple. If I click white, obviously, the pointers became white and purple, it changes to purple. I prefer purple. And then scroll direction, natural and reverse. And if you need help, you may click that and watch new, the updates. Those are under the uh, settings. And this one is the open library. I would like to uh, explore first those three dots over there and at the bottom of the right side of the screen let's click and we have this window resize when i click the window resize it appears like this we can move both sides smaller like this and on top we can adjust the height see here okay so it's uh the height uh, has been adjusted then we can lower it then we can make it big here by uh, using your uh, cursors or pointers like this okay this one and we can also adjust the height you see how big is this screen here that one screen all right and there are some other ways to adjust the screen also as you can see at the bottom, we have some uh, uh, indicators there. We have the 3x and this is the same size. If I click on 2x, you'll see the size has been reduced to 2x and 1x this size and 0.5x in this size. And when I click the check marker there, okay, the small uh, panel here, screen, appeared. Let's go first with this plus sign before we go to uh, view tabs. Okay, plus sign. As you can see, let's clear this. Okay, I press the uh, refresh and it appears like this, the default. As you can see, we only have one screen now. Okay, I will click this plus sign. Let's see what will happen. Okay, so we have now two screens, big screens in front of me and uh, the same content okay then the plus sign is still there let's see if i click it once again so i have added one more tab okay the most uh, latest uh, screen 
is in the middle and you can see there is no plus sign anymore it means that we have only maximum of three screens but this would be sufficient to enable us to monitor three screens at the same time if you want multitasking you may do so in front of this this is one of the good things that uh, Firefox reality has so we have three screens in front of us so let's check this tab view tabs so the tabs will be displayed in a small screen here so in reality you can have four <laughs> screens but this small screen will cover the big screen behind it you see all right this is just to view the tabs using this icon here i'll close that now you may delete this screen by clicking the x over there i will click that and you see it disappeared here that means the the one that i have clicked in the center disappeared and and the one in the left side it is adjusted in the middle and if i click here disappeared also this is the only one we have as you can see the uh, plus sign appears also that means that we can uh, add two more screens but let's check the view tabs here only one is in here okay i will add again three uh, screens and i will show you i will open one of the videos and let's see i change the screen at the center then you will see the uh, small uh, panel is in here for this center screen and when i click the firefox reality home on the right side uh, monitor or screen you see it uh, transfer here this small panel this is for this screen and if i click search the web or enter address here let's see this is the new screen on the right side as you can see this is the default screen and there is an arrow there uh, beside the x if you can see it and also in the middle the same if i click for example i will click the right arrow i see what happened the screen here goes to the right here if i click this left arrow this it goes to the center if i click it again then it goes to the left side you see you can change the location of your screen by just clicking the arrow there We'll play this video and let's see how it goes uh, in this big screen with Firefox Reality. Our planet's oceans are responsible for some of the most severe weather on Earth. We just rarely see it. Given let's pause. And as you can see here, we have the mini player. I will click that. The mini player appeared here in this screen. And as you can see, I can still browse the main screen. And at the same time, I can play this. How See, fast they are. Then it I can sense that most of the time there's nobody around to experience. And then I will uh, restore that in here. And now let's see this uh, default view here. Okay, this is the default view of that uh, screen and let's play. Once in a while though a ship travels into some bad weather and captures it all on so this one is play on tv and the last one is the full screen and let's see the full screen all right this is the full screen you notice that the two screens on the left side and right side both disappeared and what appeared is only this screen here because we are on uh, full screen mode underneath that you can actually resize it we have the resize there and we have the uh, video projection and we have the brightness let's try this uh, resize okay we can resize it in the uh, bigger screen 3x okay this is the 3x and we can play it the ship emergency response and rest now i will put 2x the screen becomes smaller 1x this is the one and 0.5 like this and i check the x that is uh how to use the resize uh, button there and this uh, video projection is if you want 360 
Let's check the 3D side by side. Right, this uh, screen becomes small, and you'll see. And if I will play that, I see this is 3D side by side. Then I will click again. I will pause and check the video projection. I want 360. Let's see what will happen. Okay, the 360 video is actually 360 here. Wherever you turn, you are inside of the scene. And let's play. Let's see, this is the 360 video. Amazing. This is very immersive experience with the Firefox reality. How to use the... Uh, Oculus Quest 2 for browsing the internet. Okay, I will uh, open the browser. As you can see, I have a big screen in front of me. And you can extend the uh, monitor like that, like this. Big one. Okay, it's now big see there and on top you can see the that icon and you can use that for voice command and this one to resize the browser let's see for narrow medium wide and 100% see wide and Let's go back there. Resize browser again. And yeah, it's wide. Then we can just extend it through this. Okay, it's now extended. It's big. And this one is actually request desktop website. And that one is the menu. We have the enter private mode. Close all tabs, settings, bookmarks, downloads, history, clear browsing, uh, clear browsing data, and zoom. Okay, exit private mode. Let's go back to this. And let's see, let's experience this. Uh, for example, I will open YouTube. Yeah, it's, you see it's big. And let's see, I will open, if you, uh, when you uh, click on the search, the keyboard pops up here. For example, I'm looking for the website, keep uh, adding values. Uh, it's there, then click on it. Let's see. Keep adding values. For example, I will click this. Let's see the experience. How it goes. We had a long history with money and Let's see how big it is. That's a big screen and it's good. Let's pause it. I will explain it to you. Now here, you can see how to play is on and then the subtitle. This one is the setting and multiplayer. And this one is a default view. And if I click this, this is the full screen. Let's see. Okay. So, yeah, it's a full screen here. And you see it's actually like a floating screen here and so good then it's a 2d here then let's let's play again you see how immersive it is it's a big screen Welcome to the Value Values. In this video, you will learn 
the seven insights about money that we must understand. Number one, money can buy happiness. Let's pause it. And then let's uh, click that again. Exit full screen. And let's see with the menu and other things it appeared. And we're inside the, the metaverse. This uh, house here, you see. This is where how we can use the uh, browser, the Oculus Quest 2 uh, with YouTube VR. That's all for now. Thank you for watching. I do hope you learned from this video. See you in the metaverse.